losing is not an option for Pika right now. Otherwise, Maus will just uh, solidify his chance in getting into the top eight. Mm-hmm. Do or ta- die time for the Omegas. You know what? He's he's gone with old reliable Armor King and Master Raven in their first meeting. It was a two-one in favor of Pika, but Mounts running with that momentum against Rock and Roll. Two owing him, that's got to give a slight advantage to Mounts. So that means um, we are quite sure um, mm-hmm. if if Mounts is. <laughs> that <coming> up, guys. <laughs> I mean, I if, want... Ry- if Mounts is to ride the momentum, mm-hmm. he should pick Nina against mm-hmm. Pika, he our brother here. And now we we said it time and time again. He's he's retiring the coat and microphone just for this season, just so that he can pick up the arcade stick because the Call of Duty is real for him. He wants the call to arms for him to you know just be able to uh, that perform and represent Omega, is there? Uh, yes, that is true. Again, this is his um, first conference as a player here at the Nationals. We've seen him time and time again uh, in front of the camera as a caster, but now. He lays down the mic so that he can pick up the fight stick. And here he is right now with a fighting chance to get into the playoffs. Mm-hmm. And some might even say, uh, some might even have him as a pick to be one of the most improved players because he didn't have the best uh, start to the Nationals because he was in the lower bracket, a lower part of the standings. Yeah, I think that is common to, to all our new guys, uh, especially rock and roll it was um pika nature lover and rock and roll who were uh this were this was their uh debut conference here at the national so all of them are new probably naga adjust pa sila during the first few uh mm-hmm. weeks but as we can see yung performance nila nature lover is already in top six pika right. with a fighting chance and we all know how good rock and roll was in his previous matches Yes, and as you mentioned, Ron, uh, Hot E, this is do or die time for Pika because he needs, he needs to solidify some points for him and deny Mouts any further lead against uh, his brother Jules and himself. Yes, that is true. Can, uh, actually, he's fighting for two people in this match. He's, he's, he's fighting for his chance and his brother's uh, chance. Even if he doesn't get into the top eight, this would be a big boost for Jules. Oh, monstrous skull splitter to start things out for Mouts. And now finding the real estate advantage. Ooh. Blocks the low, my goodness. Crush the low at the start and blocks it in the bottom. And look at this. Now Pika needs to play some pickup here. Very smart move there from Mouse. Not only, even if Natakasa yung throw na yon, it put Pika in a position that he, he was against the wall. Yeah. So let's see how Pika will bounce back from that. Uh, just. Momentum grabbing start from Mount. Now playing a little more compact. Ray hands get blocked. They're trading on the feet, Hot. Again, Mouse has the, the momentum from his previous match against Rock and Roll. And look at him. Mm. Nice. Tries to, tries to neutral jump there. But Pico's <laughs> ready for that. Chariot Ender. Now they switch sides. Good leg flip from Pika. And he was able to do a combo. Getting the life lead, and now he is fishing. He was trying to get a counter hit from Mouse, but unescaped throw there coming from Mouse. Yep, and now Pika one more hit away, but Pika is not letting out. But then Mouse was able to just find an opening and that his offense was able to go through. And look at that, he interrupted that string with, with a DF4, and here comes Mouse again with a combo of his own. This will take it to the wall. Oh my gosh, Blonde Bomb, Ender, and now we've seen the left side of the stage too many times, uh, Hot E. Pika needs to find his, uh, pick his shots well, because Mouse has been capitalizing on these blocks. Look at that, uh, Mouse really is applying pressure on Pika mm-hmm. with those throws. Uh, three hit combo, wipe the floor, oh, oh, to the bad habit, and Mouse still running with that momentum he gained from Rock and Roll. No round, Braun, again. It is proof that he really is a man on the mission. Mm-hmm. He wants and to get into the playoffs. He does. He does. And now, ladies and gentlemen, he is tied with Coffee Prince at 26. So if I'm Coffee Prince right now, I'll be sweating bullets. And I'm be biting all the nails I have on my fingers. Because Mautz is clawing his way to try to solidify his spot in the playoffs. 
Not only that, if and when Mouth takes the next match, he gets an extra point. Ooh. That means he'll be at 28 points. Even and, if even if Coffee Prince two owes Vermillion, pay lang sila. Mm-hmm. And then there might be there there are talks of there being a tiebreaker, but then again, Hati, we don't we don't cross the bridge until we get there. And I, I'm just glad we're calling this match because this is one of those pivotal matches that uh, everyone has to watch here in the Nationals. Pika versus Mouts. Pika going with a Master Raven. Uh, just to break it down just a little bit, you know. I, Hamouts has been really on point with starting off the round and getting those punishes from those block blows. I mean that is true. I mean because of that, um, because of that win by mm. Mouts, uh, that means Pika can only get even Pika even if Pika wins the the next two matches, he can only get two points. That means he can only go up to twenty one points. Mm -hmm. And the lowest in the ranking is Jules in the top 23. eight or twenty three. So. Again, unfortunately, Pika won't be able to get into the top eight, but he can still assist Jules. Mm -hmm. That's the most he can do. He can transfer his energy, his hamon, to Jules. It's a hamon. And just take it. It's all yours. <laughs> Going to Geometric Planes, one of the Omega's playhouses, if you would. They love picking the stage. Stage pick of comfort, if you would. Of course, this is the, the, the comfort stage of the Omega's. This is their training room, their lab, their danger room, their domain. Let's yeah, see it's... how much uh, improvement or, or... I mean, but look at that. Pika changed characters. That means this is a random stage. Oh, that's true. So the stage gods are in his favor. That is a good point you put up there. Because Pika going with the Dragonov, probably more comfy against the Nina matchup. And look at that. Caught him sidestepping. Good up forward mm -hmm. four from, from Pika. Yep. Gotta worry about that. And his Russian assaults are on point. Tries to delay the string there. But Mouts able to interrupt with the below the belt combo. Two hit. Very compact play from Mouts. Just going for the pokes. Went for the binding whip. Mouts, watch out. Kip up from Pika has rage available. Mouth needs to be careful. Hits him out of the air. Mouths, you are a madman. Good thing he went for a two and uh, for that uh two hit string. Exactly. Okay, slides in. Pika's still trying to find his footing again in this matchup. Mouts has been in control. Wow, again, predicted that low and he was ready. One point with that while rising one, one plus two punish. Okay, Mouts, he's on fire now. Pika needs to try to douse this fire and try to just seize the momentum that Mouts is just driving home. And will Pika be able to do that though? Well, no conversion from that. Oh. oh, tried to mix him up, but Pika was able to defend. Now Skull Splitter. Pika now pushing Mouts against the wall! Look at the uh, wipe the floor. <laughs> that was even a counter hit. Oh my goodness. Mouts, mighty Mouts in the house, ladies and gentlemen. 2-0 to zero against Pika. Will he be able to overthrow Coffee Prince in the seventh spot? Not if Pika plays spoiler. Match point. Match mm -hmm. point for Mouts. Oh! Ooh, hey. That was close. <laughs> Everyone saw that. Now slides in. Breaks the throw. And Pika's got throw breaks of his own. Nice duck. But Mouts still relentless with these grabs. One more string could do it. Oh, oh wow. God. Stiletto heel to the low. And Mouts has a miracle run. He got six points today, Hot E. This is a perfect day for Mouse. 